Hey y'all, it's Jessica and thank you for coming back to this special video of the seven toddler challenge. And today I do have a very special guest with you since it is the start of Christmas and you know, it's like the family time and just like, you know, being thankful for what you have. I do have a very special guest and I'll let her introduce herself. So take it away. Hi, my name is Aria and today's my birthday. And if you don't know already, Miss Aria over here is my daughter. So that's why I have a little special guest. And today, like I said, we are doing the seven toddler challenge, just something a little bit different. So she's gonna be helping me comment on things. Um, we'll see how quiet she is and or see how loud she is. Cause you know, sometimes it's a hit or miss. So let me just bring this over for you because here is the rules. So this is it. And I think this is someone said that, what's his face, James Turner? <laughs> what was the person that did this a long time ago? I don't know. So the goal is to raise seven toddlers in The Sims 4 with no mod cheats. We can't have a job. Just get the kids to the child stage. If we fail, obviously, if any kids get taken away by social services, we are going to try to do the hard route because I think that's, you know, more fun, right? Yes. So the hard route is that we just get to control the adult sim. We don't get to do the toddlers. But, you know, always we are gonna start with the babies first and we have like three days or whatever it is to get the babies, you know, aged up to a toddler. And then like the next video, we'll do the toddlers. Does that sound good? Yes. And we're not gonna hire a maid or a butler. We're just gonna try to do it just ourselves. I'll try to link it down below so that you guys can look at it. But seriously, this is all it is. Like there's nothing else to it. It's just something cool and fancy to look at. We are going to start out in Strangerville. Uh, Claire Siobhan, when she did her video, this is where she went. And I just wanted to, you know, it was super easy because it's, it's gotten, they got this like little area. And we are going to use red or rose, rose rainbow, red rainbow. Um, she is from the rainbow cast challenge that I did a while back. And I just figured why not use her. So we're just going to go ahead and dive on in and try to see if we can get these seven babies. All right, so here we are in her house. I did, obviously, as you can tell, I made it bigger for the babies whenever we do do this. And then here's a doorway, so maybe she can have some quiet time. There is a little shower over here. This is just part of the original. And then once they get to toddlers, we'll build a toddler area. And I do have child support set in, so I really don't think it's necessary to get rid of the money just yet. Because once we start having the babies, we will be getting child support. But I can get rid of it. Maybe we can just, maybe we can give ourselves what? What do you think? Mm, diamonds. Diamonds? Money-wise, girlfriend. Money-wise. Oh, um, pennies? <laughs> pennies uh, I, I can't do pennies so how about we just start out with 2000 does that sound good yeah okay so now we need to try and we need to uh, actually first thing is we need to do we need to check our gameplay because we need to have auto age as on and lifespan as normal at least for the for the babies so we need to go out and find some guys or at least introduce ourselves to some guys. So let's go over here and let's visit this residence real quick. All right, so we arrived to this little house and we already see a guy right here, Dylan Sigworth. So we are just going to friendly introduction. So we learned that Dylan is a... I am an only child. I am a parent. So obviously he already has kids, looks like. So that's pretty interesting. Probably don't want to ask him if he has a wife because that might get a little interesting. So let's go ahead and just ask him. Oh, he is a stay at home dad. Okay. Okay. So we got that one. That could be one potential man. Um, usually this place is like crawling with people. Like where is everybody? Who? Are, so this is Caleb Velter. Close enough. <laughs> So let's just go over here and do a funny introduction with him because he might be a good one too. Let's ask him about children and then we'll ask him about his day. Ask him about siblings. He doesn't have any kids. Okay, well that's good to know. He is unemployed. He does have siblings though. Let's see if there's anybody else that pops up. Who's this? Hugo. Oh, he's a teen. Can't have that. How about we actually 
go home. All right, so we just arrived and our girl is broke out with some acne, it looks like. That's nice. Really nice. Massive breakout from horno hormones or poor hygiene. Let's do a one-time treatment. Look at the fly with that mask on. She looks really different with that mask on. Oh yeah, oh, she changed into a robe. Mm. <laughs> Let's summon some Sims here. So who do we want to summon? Let's do Mortimer Goth. So Mortimer's coming over, so that's good. Let's actually give her some skills. Let's give her a little bit of cooking skills so that way she doesn't burn the house down. What do you think? What number? Mm, eight. Eight? That's pretty high. We'll do eight. Apparently he's already here, but I don't see him. I don't see him anywhere either. Oh, there he is. He's, oh. he's running now. Oh, he just welcomed himself right in the house. Okay. Let's just do a friendly introduction. Let's ask him about siblings. Ask him about children, even though we already know he does have kids. And let's ask about his career. He is an only child. That's kind of cool. He is a parent. And he's a freelance article writer. Oh, well, um, that was quick. Apparently, we don't have to do that one. That was quick. Yep. Who's this? Oh, we got our, oh, we got our crazy welcome crew coming to our house. Um. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Yeah. Can't you just, like, go out the door and say, go away? Could. We could just ignore them. It's not like we need them. Let's go ahead and do this. Okay, let's just go into our little cheat system real quick and let's see. Okay, good. So we are actually going to go ahead and do in labor. We actually just speed her up a little bit. We'll be able to have the baby already. What's Mortimer doing? Did he want to go to sleep? Yes, okay, he yes, at. that's what he did. He went to sleep. Now he's with now he went to the other side of the bed. Yep. Why? Could you just fold over? Yeah, probably. When are we having this kid? Oh, in zero minutes. Okay, so hopefully, maybe once she gets done. There we go. We got a bassinet now. Okay. Ooh. So what should girl. we? We do got a girl. What should we name her? Bethany. Bethany. How about we name her something with an M? That way we know that this is Mortimer's kid. Michelle. Michelle. Michelle Rainbow. There we go. Caleb is on his way over. And he's right here. There he is. Okay. Mm, look at this little baby over her. Aww. She looks so cute when she ever she's sleeping. They all do. Mm hmm Until they wake up and they're screaming and got poopy pants. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and now they're both sleeping. That means all of them sleeping. Wait, what is Caleb doing? Oh, Probably getting ready to leave. Up. Okay, good. Here we go. Pregnancy phase. We did it. Okay, so she's yes. in labor now. Oh, it looks like she peed the bed, too. Oh. That's nice. Really nice. So take a shower. Take a shower. I'm going to get her some water, too. Oh, what? He just left? Yeah. Ah! He did. Look at her little belly. Oh. He didn't even say bye. Caleb didn't even say bye. Nope. How rude. <laughs> He's rude. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is Caleb's baby, so we should have it start with the letter C. So what should we name it with a C name? Oh, um, girl again? Huh? Girl again? Yeah? Uh, it's Colin. Huh? The girl name is Colin the girl game? The girl name? Yeah, Colleen is a girl name. You want two L's or one L? One L. Aww. And let's just go ahead and we will feed both of them. That way they're both done. Hello. What was his last name? Do you remember Dylan's last Oh, Sing. Sigamore. Sigamore. That's the word. Sigamore. 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 Dylan. Sigamore. Sigworth. Sigworth? Sigworth. Oh. We were getting it wrong. He's going to be over. And about, I don't know, 
Maybe soon, I don't know when. No, he's okay. Oh, you just came right on in. He did. Still. <laughs> Come on, Michelle. Well, she just got fed, so she shouldn't be hungry. Oh, oh she's got diaper. a dirty diaper. <laughs> okay, so pregnancy phase in labor. Whoo, there we go. Have a baby. I'm so excited to see if it's a boy or a girl. I and this is Dylan, so we need to have a D, D name. It is a boy. Finally. So what should we name him? Uh, What's the D name? Diego? Oh yeah, Diego. Okay. Diego. 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 There you go, Diego. Diego. And I'm glad that's a boy one because it feels like a pink one. It wouldn't be right. Let's invite Cameron over. We don't have a C name, do we? No, I don't think so. Wait. Okay. Yeah, we do. No, we don't. Yeah, we do. We do? Yeah. Oh, we do, don't we? <laughs> no. Oh well, we've already invited him over at this point. He's coming over, so. So if we get this, this will be our fourth baby. So no, we'll have three more. Ah. Okay, so she was C, right? Yes. So let's do this. Let's look through some since we had such a hard time last time. Connie. Connie. Caroline. Oh, Caroline. Yeah, Caroline. That's cute, ain't it? Okay, we'll do Caroline. Let's let's do Bob. Or Eric. Eric Lewis. Yeah. Oh no. This baby's fussing. <laughs> Probably hungry again. Yeah. Michelle is like the one that wants the attention. Okay. Eric. So we need an E name. Um. What's the last one again? It's a girl. <laughs> so what E name do we want? Elizabeth? Yeah. Okay. We'll do Elizabeth. Bob hasn't come over yet, has he? No, I don't think so. Let's do Bob. Oh, I saw Olivia, but it's a girl. <laughs> pancakes? Oh, that was one of my spelling words last week. Oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> my gosh, look at all this. Oh, my gosh. At least she's hydrated. Yeah. She's super tired, though. Pregnant. We got a male. Wait, what is a male? A girl? A boy. Oh, no, I have to go in the pink. Thing. He can go in the yellow. Okay. <laughs> Okay, it's a boy. Boy, we knew that. We need to have a B name. B. Brody. Brody. Ooh. That's kind of cute, right? Yeah, yeah Brody Rainbow. That's yeah. cute. All right, Brody Rainbow, <laughs> welcome to the crazy household. Yeah. Welcome to the stinky diaper world. Yep, let's go ahead and we'll feed him too. And then we just need one more baby. And yeah. Victor. No, we didn't. Oh, wait. I hope he has a girl because I have the perfect girl name. Okay, we'll do Victor. Yeah. Uh, and it's kind of close to Victor. I don't want to tell you guys because I already gave you, I already told you, but I don't want to say it again. Oh my gosh, look how many dirty diapers. One, two, two three, three, four, five, 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 five kids five? with dirty diapers. Oh my. All right, finally, we did it. We All did right, it. so I go have the baby. Now, okay, so it's a boy. boy. And that was V, right? Uh-huh. I had the perfect girl name. Victoria. Mm. Vikram? 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 Vincent? Yeah, Vincent. Yay. Oh my gosh. All she, right. There we go. Like, I saw that. She did. He just like, <laughs> came on out. Yeah. Now we got to get all these kids to. Toddlers. Toddlers. When's their birthdays? So, Michelle's is supposed to be tomorrow, but I really want all of theirs to be then. Wait, let's Michelle called change. Me. Let's change this to no. No. And then that way we can age them up together. So, I want them all to have the same day. Me too. Which was Wednesday. So, we got to make it to Wednesday. With all these crying babies. Yay. Okay. <laughs>
Oh, three of them. Oh, four of them are awake. Wait. Oh, um. Have two more hours. Yeah, we'll go until like maybe noon Wednesday or something. Okay, good. <laughs> good, good, good. There we go. Probably needs to go to Cuddle. 
Okay, it's, it's 11 o'clock right now, oh, so hopefully we're going to do this cuddle session with them and, and then we'll, we'll have it done. What happens if we don't win? Well, we do. We only got like 30. Well, we're almost there. Time she gets done with all these cuddlings and we're done. It's past 12, so we made it. Oh, oh. Alright, let's see what she's going to be. This is Michelle. Let's see. Mean! No, we're fussy. No, we don't need a no fussy one. Oh my gosh, she keeps giving it to us. Oh no. Oh no, please don't me. Oh, Angel, yes. Angel. Angelic, okay. Oh, what does Angelic mean? It, angelic is... She's an easygoing toddler. They never... Are defiant. They don't throw a temper tantrum. They can easily talk to strangers. Uh, All right, here's Colleen. She is inquisitive. These toddlers gain thinking skills slightly faster, and they are the happiest when learning something. Inside, if they haven't learned anything in a while. And Diego, here's Diego. He yes. is independent, so that's good. Oh, what? Michelle, why don't you just go in the crib? Okay, but we can get rid of these. Let's get rid of these. Yeah, get rid of them. Get rid of those. Caroline is independent. Yay! Yeah, Let's go ahead and lock this door because I don't want them coming out everywhere. So we're going to lock door for everyone but Rose. Elizabeth was next, right? Yeah. All right, Elizabeth is a charmer. She loves to socialize and they earn communication skill faster. And they don't suffer stranger danger from from strangers. They can share the love with other Sims. All right, who's next? This Brody. is, is it Brody? Brody. Yeah, Brody. Oh, Brody is angelic. Okay. Mm. All right, Vincent, you're independent. Yay! <laughs> All right, we did it. Yay! Yay! So that's it for round one. We did it. Thank you, Arya, so much for joining me in this lovely thing. I'm going to go ahead and do a little makeover on these kids and I'm going to send her off because it is a little bit past her bedtime and she will be joining us for the actual seven toddler challenge which is actually what we're supposed to be doing but I just wanted them all to be different and have you know that variety of different looking kids. So thank you guys so much for taking the time out of your day and watching these videos with me. I really do appreciate it and if you haven't already make sure you hit that subscribe button. It does just help our little village to grow and make sure you hit that bell. It just sends you notifications so that you never miss one of my uploads and make sure you give this video a big sweet thumbs up. It just lets me know that I'm doing something right and that you're liking this kind of content. Any last words, Aria? Bye. <laughs> Bye. See you in my next video, guys. Bye. Mwah.